Welcome everybody, and this is the unboxing of the Mortal Kombat! One collector's edition. Let's get into it. That's right folks, back to the beginning. Liu Kang has taken over the hourglass and has crafted a new era. Live and strive in peace or combat your enemies in bloody strife. Anyway guys, the collector's edition, we're gonna open this up and see what we got here. I will say that this is a finely crafted cover here and the box is of premium quality. We got here on the back side. This is not a toy, so don't be playing around. You know, we got a dragon on the front with the Mortal Kombat 1 title. Yeah, this is really nice. And we're about to dive in and see exactly what's going to be on the inside. But I am very excited that this game has been getting very good reviews so far. Uh, people are loving the story, people are loving the combat, so I cannot wait to dive in, as we will be diving in to this goodness. So we have some collective art uh, pieces here. They definitely took the time to make sure that this stuff is protected. But let's actually take the uh, cards out. Let's see what we have here. The, uh, uh, the company who crafted these goes by the name of Horse, I believe. Yeah, I mean, these are pretty cool. It's a little bit different than what we're used to seeing. I like the abstract type of art a little bit, you know, just like with, with the colors and, and whatnot. It's like really nice. That's really cool. Definitely should frame a few of those. That's Liu Kang here. Here is our dragon. Do these actually go together? What do you guys think? I can't tell from this side. Maybe not. I don't know. I think they look pretty cool, though. Like I said, you know, it's kind of unique. Kind of unique, you know, this kind of art. I like it. So, those are great. Let's get on to what we have here. This is the game. This is for Series X. It is the Premium Edition. So, it does come with the six new playable characters, five... Uh, new cameo characters, one week early access to the DLC characters, the John claude Van Damme skin for Johnny Cage, 2700 Dragon cur Crystals, which will most likely be used for in-game currency. We have the Cameo Fighters, Invasions, Immersive Story Campaign. Like I said, I'm definitely ready to dive into this. It's great, plus the Premium Edition is allowing you to have access uh, starting at the 14th and uh, I picked this up yesterday and I will definitely be diving into this this weekend you guys can be assured of that the steel case here comes in some quality packaging so how about we take that out take a look at it and definitely a I would definitely say a, a step up from what the Mortal Kombat 11 steel case is. I love the white and the dragon. I love the art and it goes around the side here from side to side. That's pretty sick. And on the inside, we have what looks to be like the character uh, screen, but you got dragons and mountains in the background. Definitely a nice place to reside if you want to go do some fishing. And we got the uh, Mortal Kombat symbol here on the other side. I love it. Definitely a good quality uh, steel case for sure. How about we dive into the next phase here? Which would be the Liu Kang statue. So just one moment, guys, and we will get this on out of here. Let's see, yeah, definitely, they, they took the time to really make sure that this uh, statue was protected well. And how about we be real careful grabbing him out of here. And you know what, this is, uh, this is pretty sick because it has already come, it's already come uh, like basically built up there's nothing much that you really have 
to do with it. And I love how the dragons are circling him on both sides and they come up, you know, on uh, his left and his right. And he's got his signature pose. That's pretty, that's pretty sick. We got the Mortal Kombat symbol down here. And at the bottom, we got Course Mortal Kombat, the dragon logo made in China. But yeah, this is uh, this is a nice change too because you know we've always had Mortal Kombat collectors items always featuring Sub Zero or Scorpion. Please take us back to Mortal Kombat Nine Collectors Edition Tournament Edition that came with the fight stick. That thing was sick quality, sick quality for sure. And then the Collectors Edition was actually a statue of Scorpion impaling Sub Zero from like one of a wall to like another. So that was pretty cool. Then, you know, Mortal Kombat X, I don't remember if it actually had a collector's edition. I think it only had like a, a premium edition. As far as I can remember, uh, just digital items and combat pass and all that. And the Mortal Kombat 11 was the replica of uh, Scorpion's mask. And the European version was the replica of Sub-Zero's mask. So, I mean, those collector's items were pretty unique in their own way. But it's nice that we have this change here when it comes to featuring Liu Kang as the actual, you know, you know, prized, focused character of the series. So, yeah, I like that. And I really like this. This is really nice. I'm definitely going to have to put this in my case over there. So, hope that you guys enjoy the quality focus here if i could give you guys just like a brief uh summary of what happened with this so i originally pre-ordered this i originally pre-ordered the statue the well you know the collector's edition and everything through target because the day that the pre-orders opened up it was kind of a mess in a way amazon didn't have their pre-orders open gamestop didn't have their pre-orders open so you're just in best buy they didn't have their pre-orders open either so you're just kind of like running between site to site trying to kind of figure out like who am I going to pre-order from who's going to have like their orders open first so for me Target was the one who had the orders open first I had never got an update from them I went to check my order summary yesterday and it said that it was back ordered uh, actually no this was Wednesday it said it was back ordered so the projected date was after the release the, the initial release is going to be September 19th and I was like, look, you know, we're getting these collector's editions and we're not even getting them on release. You know, this has happened like several times. The last few collector's editions that I've gotten supposedly supposed to be released on the day of and, you know, it just didn't happen like that. So this was going to be the same situation. So I kind of started looking around to see maybe if I could maybe just get the premium edition and go ahead and, um, uh, you know, just go ahead and secure the game early, like I initially intended. But like most of the premium editions, physical copy wise, were sold out. So, through a slice of luck, I went to Best Buy's site and they actually had the Series X Collector's Edition uh, available and they had one left. So, I kind of think that, that that was my lucky opportunity to go ahead and just cancel my Target pre order go with Best Buy, picked it up yesterday, and here we are, the unboxing is complete. Alrighty guys, thank you for joining me on today's unboxing of the Mortal Kombat 1 Collector's Edition. We got a real nice look at the statue, like I said, very unique uh, style of statue, very great quality, amazing job by course, and also these abstract style art cards uh, that feature, you know, the dragons and Liu Kang, definitely unique art style in that regard. Uh, along with the uh, Steelbook, Steelbook, great quality game. We know that it's going to be great. And the uh, sh premium box that this came in, definitely quality art. So you could tell 
There may not be a lot of items here, but it's like they say, guys, quality over quantity. And I think that they really did a, a good job with this. So definitely appreciate you joining me unboxing what we have here taking a real good look at everything on the inside and if you guys would like to see more content like this make sure to stay connected to the channel because i got another unboxing coming up i actually wanted to get to this a little bit sooner but you know timing just wasn't on my side and you know i've been just dealing with some other things so i got another unboxing that i'll hope to get ready uh by this weekend as far as filming and then i'll go through the editing process of it and if you guys also enjoyed the little tiny intro i had for this and how you know i was able to kind of give you guys an in-depth look at uh, what we have on the inside of the box here you can throw a like on it i would definitely appreciate that and if you're playing mortal kombat 1 what do you think of the story so far don't give me too many spoilers but you know just let me know like if you guys are having a good experience you know what's your favorite character that you've picked up your favorite cameo character that you've joined up with your main fighter i would definitely like to hear that or anything mortal kombat related guys and i will catch you next time when the fight begins Whoopsies!